Opposition leader Mia Motley has called for better conditions at Temple Yard, the city. She lamented the fact that vendors and craftspeople there were forced to operate without electricity and water. It is a crime. It is a scandal that you here operate in the center of this country without water and without electricity. And there's no excuse for it. I have raised it a few times. I do not have the power to change it yet. But as God is my witness, trust me, it cannot happen. You cannot spend $28 million on a building in Kelowna Road by the Grotto. Have it closed up for two years, 25 months to be specific. Got electricity in it and not a human being living in it. And you here, where the people are, no electricity. Something wrong in this country. Something wrong. Miss Motley was speaking on Sunday night following the bi weekly Culture Live concert hosted by Temple Yard Productions. Miss Motley urged those gathered to speak up about their needs while promising to do what she could to assist them. On the front road, a derelict building closing you from the eyes of the people of this country is wrong. And, and, and believe you me, we can do this thing. On the music, the law is there, but the law is there. 60% of every radio station is to play Caribbean music unless they get an exemption from the minister. You understand? But perhaps what you need to be asking for is if other people can have dedicated radio stations, then so shall the Rastafarian community. You understand? Because until you speak and get your message out, nothing is going to change. So I ask us to walk. We are not going to run like Usain Bolt in two years because things dread. And I hear the fool of fella. But you will walk like men and women with dignity. And once we start walking with a straight back with dignity, then we can set about to run like Bolt.